Hi guys, it is Little Kelly here and today we are going to be playing with Lego Duplo again but this time it is going to be the ice cream set. So it looks on the front that it's going to be a lot of fun, a lot of colours, pretty simple. And then on the back it's all the combinations you can make for your ice creams. So it looks pretty good. So let's open it up and see what parts we get inside. So guys, I have laid out all the pieces that we got. So let's take a look. We've got a kind of yellow one with white and then a single yellow piece. So I kind of just noticed that they're, they all kind of have a matching color. So I lined them up that way. Then there's a blue one, but that one has blue and green on top. Yellow and orange, then a yellow block. One with sprinkles. And then the green block, a lime green block. Then it looks kind of like strawberry with chocolate sauce, I'd say. And then a pink block, then a white and pink, a light pink, and then pink. You also get three cones. No, I thought there was only going to be one, but it turns out there's three in that set, so that's pretty cool. We also get these pieces. So there's a red one, a brown one, another brown one with curves, an orange one, a green single block. We have one that looks like it uh, could be a popsicle stick, some whipped ice cream top and some berries and an orange one. I've also opened up the instructions to the inspiration inspiration page so we can have a look and I'm thinking of making some of these. I'm thinking it'll be a lot of fun. So let's get going. So for the first one I was thinking about making this gigantic one so we may as well start big and start as we mean to go on. So let's see, um, we could do it in that order I guess. So. Let's see if we can remember the colors. I'll leave it here so we can have a look. Right, so we're gonna need a cone. That's pretty obvious. Then in the picture it has a blue one, single one right there. And then we can start piling them up. So it starts off with the yellow and it just clips in like so. Next color is the dark pink with the chocolate sauce melting all down it, which looks pretty yummy. So we've got two on so far. And then we get the pink one, the light pink one, and then we have a three. And then for the fourth one, I think we'll do the orange one that matches the picture. So we're on four. Hmm, number five is the blue one. And then six is the sprinkles which look yummy and then on top it has the whipped cream which goes on like that so there we have it our first ice cream i don't know about you but i would never be able to eat all of that ice cream if it was real i'd be so full i would probably get brain freeze but i think it looks pretty cool all the colors are there and it looks lovely so we should start making another one, I guess. So I'll take all these apart. They're really easy to clip on. Now, so for our next cone, we're gonna do the next one on the list. So it's this one right here. It looks a lot simpler than that, a lot smaller, but I think it will still be just as good. So we have the cone again. Can't have an ice cream without a cone. Well, you could if it's not in, you had it in a tub, I guess, but in this case, we're using the gum. So then we have a blue right there. Then we have the pink, just like the picture. I'll remind you what the picture looks like. That one right here. And then we have the red top, which just fits on there. So what do you think? Does it match the photo? I think so. And I think that one's a more, I'd probably be able to finish that ice cream if I was pretty hungry. So we can disassemble that one again. So how about we do the next one, which is a popsicle. So we have our little popsicle stick. And then the end color is the orange, which fits on this way. 
there we go then the next one is the pink which goes on here then the orange which goes on here the red goes on top and the brown and we top it off with a pink which is my favorite color so what do you reckon i think it's the same yep i think we did a good job right i think enough of that let's just make up our own why not so let's take apart all of these right i'm gonna do a cone then i'm gonna use the orange on the bottom I'm gonna fit in there. Then we're gonna use the orange one on top. I'm gonna use the light pink in between. Then the pink one. Then the lime green with the sprinkles. This is looking like a huge cone. Then I'm gonna go with the green with Mm, what one was the green one for? Yeah, the blue and green. No, wait, we have a blue. Uh oh. Yeah, we'll just go with it anyway. So we got the blue, with the blue on top. And then we'll go with the pink. This is looking absolutely ginormous. I can barely fit it on the camera. Then pink on top. Holy moly getting bigger yellow whoa then we'll top it off with some berries so guys I don't even know if you can see how big that ice cream is I don't think anyone would be able to eat all of that like I genuinely and even a comment below if you think that if it was real ice cream would you be able to eat it I just think it would be impossible yeah so that's that one let's make another popsicle because we haven't made many of them we made a lot of ice creams but not many popsicles oh forgot about that orange one I'll just take them apart like so so popsicle let's see we'll start with I mean we could start with orange we have to start with orange, it's the only one with the right base. So orange, um, go with this one. Let's do a blue and a green. Let's see if we can make a really big one. That color, that color. Oh, I'm really liking these colors, really. Um, some pinks that are attached back here. Light pink and the pink. That's pretty cool. And we'll do brown with the extra brown on top because who doesn't like chocolate? And then red. So we have the full popsicle made and it looks delicious. So then, or we could put the berries on top. I mean, that would be pretty cool. Pretty funky looking. I mean, there's so many things you could do with this. Now, what I was thinking to make this a little bit more different and not just be playing with Lego was I thought we could play with a bit of Play-Doh as well. So I was thinking we could maybe decorate some of the ice creams with some Play-Doh or I don't know really, but I just thought we'd give it a go. So let's make a simple ice cream cone. So we have cone, this one and that. We'll just leave it at that, just the one, and see. So I've got this color Play-Doh here. Let's open it up. It's kind of like a lilac -y purple, which I think would suit that color of the cone. So then I'm gonna just, I mean, well, somehow, I don't really know what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna go with it, see what I can come up with. So I'm just rolling it between my fingers, between my hands. And then I'm gonna wrap it. Oh, still not long enough. Make it a little bit skinnier. It looks like a snake. Pre 
be funny. Let's see, let's see if it fits all the way around now. Oh, nearly just spread it out a little. See, look. So now we have like a purple outside to our ice cream. Let's stick that together. And that looks pretty cool to me. Flatten it up some more. So, I mean, we didn't have a purple um, ice cream Lego piece, but now that we've spread that out, it looks like ice cream. So, should we put one more on and add another color? So, let's do this. We're gonna put the blue on, and guess what color I have? I like to be matching. So, I'm just gonna open that up. We've got that cool blue color inside. Take some out. Break some off, I guess. And we're gonna do the same thing. We're gonna roll it between our hands, making it nice and long. To fit around. I probably put too much on this one because I don't think I put enough on the other one. Just break a bit off, like so. Put it back in the play doh just so we don't lose it. And then we're gonna spread all this one out. So it's kind of like my other video when we were making Play-Doh ice creams, except we're using Lego too. So we don't have to just use one toy, we can use two. See that's pretty cool. And then I'm gonna put on the whipped ice cream on top. And uh, maybe, I don't know, just put a little circle or something on the very top to like, like a cherry. I know this is in red, but it's kind of luminous -y color. So I'm just gonna put some of that, take some of that off. Roll it into a ball in my hands. And stick it on top. See, I think that looks pretty cool. What do you think? Right guys, so leave a comment below if you thought you'd be able to eat the monster ice cream and if you think that mixing the toys up is pretty fun because I think it's pretty awesome. I mean, I love Play-Doh and I love Lego, so why not combine the two? And I think that looks pretty cool. So thanks guys for watching. Please subscribe and I'll see you again soon.